Did you know your phone has more computing power than the Apollo guidance computer? In 1969, and humanity is on the edge of something epic. NASA launches Apollo 11, with brave astronauts like Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin hurtling toward the moon. And what's guiding them through the vast emptiness of space? A clunky box called the Apollo Guidance Computer, or AGC for short. This thing was a beast for its era. It calculated rocket burns, navigated stars, and even handled landing on the lunar surface. It ran at a pokey 2 megahertz clock speed, which is basically how fast its brain could think, and had just 4 kilobytes of RAM. Enough memory to store maybe a single low-res selfie today. The whole computer weighed 30 kilograms and will draw 55 watts while running. That's roughly five times a modern smartphone's. But here's where it gets mind-blowing. Fast forward to now and that smartphone in your pocket. It's not just a phone, it's a supercomputer that dwarfs the AGC. Your average iPhone or Android blasts along at 2 to 3 gigahertz, over 2,000 times faster in raw speed alone compared to the AGC. And in terms of overall processing power, we're talking 100,000 to millions of times more muscle, depending on how you measure it, like instructions per second or floating point operations. It has gigabytes of RAM, billions of times more storage, and can juggle apps, AI, and 4K videos without breaking a sweat. The technologies your smartphone's able to pack together is like magic compared to the AGC. Therefore, the next time you're doom-scrolling memes or snapping pics, pause and appreciate you're carrying tech that could have run circles around the machine that conquered the moon. This explosion in computing power means we can solve problems faster create wild innovations like virtual reality worlds, and connect globally in ways the Apollo team could only dream of. Drop it in the comments and subscribe for more interesting facts.